Hi friends and welcome back to a new video from me. Now a gear video and it's a bit of layering and gear me up in the proper way when I'm going to the mountains or I do my hiking or expedition. Yes, um, I not wear the full um, setup on gear. Uh, I want to show you a bit of overview what I wear and what I want to wear and what I like to wear. <laughs> So um, so I have fun with this video and I shall you start now uh, with the basic. Normally I wear a special t-shirt um, with uh, out of marine wool and um, long uh, long john uh, pants, this very long like boxer shorts uh, shaped uh, marine wool pants but for this setup because I'm indoor and it's very warm, I have a little AC running here. I will have normally a t-shirt and a normally um, pants, as a normally underpant. I wear here a Fieraven cap pen because I like this um, style of pen. Um, disclaimer, and by the way, I'm not sponsoring for any of this company. I buy, buy, bought myself everything on my own. And I buy it because I like it and I can move around so so yes that is a normally t-shirt from the company Mammut Fieraven uh, cap pants I don't wear any boots uh, today because it's for me easier to do it and then mostly um, I'm a guy I'm not very start to freeze a lot or again when I'm going to the high mountain I wear a bit different uh, underwear. So the next thing I wear is this nice Norona fleece and I hope you can see me clearly. That is a very great feeling fleece when I wear it. Uh, when it's not get too warm and not too cold, I wear this mostly when I'm on a base camp or when I'm in the shed or uh, in the similar locations. Yes, it's a bit small, but I like it. I have no problem to wear it. I have the appropriate size and um, it's worked great for me. So, um, that is the Nornorna hood fleece, very nice fleece. Oh, and I wear a nice full zip hood and very nice size. I wear this, for example, under my dry suit too, with a simple, a similar pen. Or I wear this under my dry suit. Um, this is a very great setup now, and hope you can see everything. I like the color blue. Uh, maybe in the next video, I'll show my Mammoth Extreme collection on what I uh, wear with the mammoth gear that is very old around the 90s gear that is maybe in around up to 2010 gear I'm a gear freak by the way and I like to not only to wear it I like to know something about the gear and so so next step about mostly when it's not so cold I wear then a jacket or sometimes a down jacket but in this particular use case I see where now my Fieraven cap jacket. That is it. Very nice. I like the style of the jacket. Um, yes, Fieraven cap. And it's a size XL in the same color like the pants. And it's a bit tricky to wear it. No. Sorry. So you can see me now I have this jacket on and that is mostly the way and thing what I wear when I'm out in the mountains fishing sometimes. This is great something for fishing too. Um, it's a great movement. Everything I can do with them. Very nice color, very nice size and Great gear, it's very, it's match very great with the pants. Uh, this blue is very nice. 
I um, get the inspiration to wear it from a machine guy. Um, he wears this, for example, work with dogs often. And yes, it's really, really great, great gear. And um, I'm very appreciate that his, this guy helped me a lot with this gear. Um, the hood is great, it's a very huge hood. Like when you have storm problems, um, very great. That's the front, and that is the side. Very, very amazing hood. I like to wear it. Um, I could wear it sadly not so often because it's very warm today, but if it gets very cold, I wear this for both. For example, fishing in Hamburg or fishing with other boats. This gear is very nice again, water. You can wax it. But personally, this is my personal opinion, I not recommend this gear for sailing. Then I have other gear. For example, in the last video, you saw my, maybe you can see it or you won't see it, my red uh, dry suit. This is a very nice, amazing piece of gear for going sailing in very crushing water. And so, um, yes, that is um, the particular gear then. This gear is, for example, nice when you're going out with dogs, when you're hiking in the mountains, when you're uh, camping outside, or oh, have to work outside. Uh, a good guy for me, the musher, used it for working. I know some um, guys, camera operators, often they use this gear for working, and I like to use it too. And it great movement, y'all. And yes, like big pockets around and stuff, everything inside from, for example, camera bus, batteries or so, or other things. Uh, what I would more like if I, if I have pockets here around. I have an older jacket from the, around the 90s or up to the, the 2Ks. I have here some pockets to put my hands in. That would be amazing. And yes, um, that was the normally layer what I wear um, when it's not so cold. I can wear that, yes, my personal uh, opinion, I wear, can wear that around zero degrees with a little bit of wind and I got not freeze in this when I move, when I'm go staying and so I need a big park or a down jacket. Uh, be patient when you do that itself. Yes. Um, I unzip it now because I want to show you another nice piece of gear. That's the thing why... Um, Unzip this, take off this jacket to the fleece because the next piece of gear is very, very warm. Normally, I, I show it in the proper way, it's got very warm, but I hope I can uh, do it here. It's not easy because it's very, very warm in my apartment here. Uh, zipper is stuck in here suddenly, so I try to zip it, close it. And not something not easy because there's something with the zipper not in a good way. And um, now I wear it on this gear over that is a down suit from the North Face. That is this beauty. And what I want to say to this, this is a down suit from the 2000 around, the older model. Now we have to cal calculate it's around 20 years. A very nice grey down suit, I like it. Very nice made um, from the 2000s. I got it from another nice guy. I um, have around, by the way, 20, around 20 down suits that have this nice side pockets. This is a great, amazing, I like this kind of pockets. Um, yes, the, the North Face 800 series from the summer series. They are much different down suit from the North Face. I have the old one that is around the 90s down suit. This with this big hood. And I have this and I have the news model too. And that is a very great uh, down suit. So I try to zip up me in this too.
Yes, this suit is used. So it has some stains on it. And, but I like it. Now I have no uh, size problems. Um, this is a great size. And now you can see me completely gear up in my normally expedition gear. Now I try to use, take my harness on it. That is a very easy harness, but for fun I do it now. Um, I have to untangle it first, because I don't use this harness really anymore for climbing, because that is too small, not too small. Um, yes, I don't use it. I, I, I have better other harnesses too, so I hope I can wear it now, probably. It's very warm here inside to wear it, but I try it for you best to show my expedition gear. I have to check only the disc because I have not much disc space on this sadly full of car, full of gear, uh, full of gear, sorry, full of car. I have a very small car in this. And for fun, a carabiner inside. Yes, that's me. And I hope you can see me clearly. That is, that is great. So that's me completely suited up and geared up in my expedition gear. Um, normally I wear some boots, big gloves, ice pickle, ice uh, X, sorry, ISX. Um, I'm ready for run. Normally, normally I have a balaclava on my face, a goggles, a Google goggles, goggles, and a Google goggle. Google is a search engine. <laughs> and yes. I hope you can see something. I hope you could understand something. Um, it's very warm inside this. I like this down suit. It has great pockets here and here, ideal movement. And I have my fun in this gear. So I wish you fun in your gear. If you have questions, seriously, please put that in the comment. Have fun with your gear. And yes, I see you next time. I say bye for now.